every day in Oklahoma. Cutting edge advances are made in the field of biomedical research. We have more than 600 patents, you know, worldwide patents, uh, that come from our discoveries. Important breakthroughs are taking place that improve the quality of life here in Oklahoma. And we felt like we could really make an impact on the health of Oklahoma's children. And across the United States. We have had some major discoveries that have not only improved the health of Oklahomans, but also have helped to improve the health of people throughout the country. Vital discoveries that push Oklahoma into new frontiers of improving public health. And so our reputation nationally has expanded. And so we don't have to worry about people reviewing our grants and, and saying, from Oklahoma, who's there? A driving force behind this groundswell is the National Institutes of Health IDEA program. The IDEA program consists of two components. COBRE, which expands and develops biomedical research faculty capabilities, and INBRE, which enhances research infrastructure and helps to develop the next generation of research scientists in Oklahoma. Over the past decade, Oklahoma scientists have been awarded IDEA grants that total more than $150 million. The COBRE Awards and the INBRE Award we have in Oklahoma have resulted in some basic research that has actually gone on and been translated into potential cures and therapies for major diseases from HIV, cancer research, diabetes research. At the Dean A. McGee Eye Institute in Oklahoma City, Dr. John Ash and his colleagues are searching for new treatment in the leading cause of blindness. So our research is focused on identifying ways that we can keep people from going blind due to, to, to retinal degenerative disorders that will typically affect people in their 50s through 80s, 80 years of age. And some of these are, most of these are in fact genetically controlled. And the fact is that they get those genes at conception, but they don't go blind for five, six, seven, or eight decades of life. Dr. Ash hopes his research will lead to even more discoveries and disease therapeutics. Um, I think what we're doing is relative, relevant, not just for age-related degenerations in the retina, but because it's part of the central nervous system, I also think it's relevant to degenerations in the entire central nervous system. Just a few blocks away on the campus of the OU Health Science Center, Dr. Kevin Short uses IDEA grant funding to improve the health of Oklahoma children through his important diabetes research. Well, we're finding that uh, even a little bit of exercise has major impact on insulin resistance, the precursor to diabetes. So the impact of our research is we hope to encourage schools and uh, community organizations and all kinds of children's organizations to encourage more physical activity in today's youth. We love to show the kids and their parents how their clinical values have improved in just a short time with us. And that's all through the support of the COBRE program. At the Oklahoma Medical Research Foundation, COBRE grants help scientists get on the fast track to success. Then, if you have adequate support and let these people really run from the outset, uh, they can go on to, to great success and make discoveries, uh, ones that we call discoveries that make a difference. We don't have many cures. We have treatments, but we don't have many cures. And that's what we're all striving for, to make those treatments better. If we don't stay at this, it won't be any better 10 years from now than it is today. So we need a balanced approach. Certainly we have to care for the least among us today, but we need to be thinking about how do we make the world better for tomorrow. IDEA also helps make the world better for tomorrow by creating an environment that helps to develop and foster the best and brightest young minds so that they can be the next generation of research scientists. The Enbury was a great program. I was able to dedicate an entire summer out to what I was doing in my research. I was already knee deep in my research and I didn't, I didn't have the time or the ability to pay for what we needed to do. So it got us funding for some new equipment. And it also allowed me to spend my summer months actually at the lab instead of trying to work at some other job. In addition to the medical breakthroughs on the horizon, the IDEA grants hold another key benefit to Oklahoma. So we've actually enhanced the economy of Oklahoma because we've had to bring in new researchers, biomedical researchers. They buy houses, they shop at our grocery stores. It impacts the economy immensely. The Oklahoma IDEA program opening the door for the next great biomedical breakthrough.
and generating the next generation of scientists and health professionals, helping Oklahoma grow and thrive.